Hello there folks, I'm Dan Brown from asortofinterestinlife.com and instead of joining me on board my humble little boat home, you're joining me in my mum's dining room with this lovely little dog and these lovely bikes. These are all from Mango Bikes. The two multicoloured ones are single speed bikes that you can also set up as fixies. But in this video, we're very much interested in this. This is the 18 speed Mango Bikes Black Series road bike. And this particular model is called the Classy Silver Edition. You can also customise their geared bikes as well. But let's get out of this field and have a few first impressions. This was the first ever bike ride that I had done on uh, one of these bikes. So I was very much interested to get out there and properly enjoy this as a proper road bike with all the gears and all the rest of it, as I had been riding a single speed bike mainly as a proper fixed gear bike for the last year and a half. So suddenly having 18 gears, I was very happy indeed, especially on some of the little hills in this first ever ride. Equally, I was very pleased to find that the bike very much operated in a smooth manner. I don't know why I said that in such a weird way, but basically the point is still the same. It's a very smooth bike and everything works very well. The gears all change nice and smoothly and very quickly, which is always a bonus. And basically everything's exactly what you would want and expect from a decent road bike. Uh, the interesting thing for me personally was getting back, uh, getting used to, again to having proper drop bars. I absolutely love drop bars and being able to really lean over like I am there and really put the pressure down and force into the pedals as well as obviously keeping yourself crouched low and nice and aerodynamic. But after not having drop bars and not having the brake levers and gear levers right on the very, very front of the bike, on the very front of the handlebars like they are on most road bikes like this, it took me a little while and a few minutes to really settle into exactly how I wanted to hold my hands and where I wanted them on the handlebars and how I could best grip onto the brake levers if I needed to stop in an emergency, more on that in just a second, and equally the um, gear shifters are just behind the brake levers, so it's almost as if it's one lever separated into three little parts I feel, as you can see going downhill and being able to lean right over and obviously not having a fixed gear bike and being able to just stand on the pedals and coast was very nice. And um, yeah, all in all, I am very pleased with it. And I think it's got a very nice minimalist and very clean look, this silver version, particularly because it's not a very shiny silver. It's a matte sort of silver, if there is such a thing. But as we're about to zoom in the camera here to better see a dramatic moment, I found I was easily able to stop when this happened. A random little dog decided to quickly run out and dart out in front of me. I just cut that nice and low so we didn't see the owner. Um, so yeah, as we head back into town a little bit uh, more urban uh, biking and you can see the sun starting to set low there. Ah, lovely stuff. You can tell that winter's on its way. This was only early on in the afternoon or early evening. I just wanted to throw this in to show you why I didn't uh, show you the proper trip from that little jetty in the pond over to the gate at the start of the video because obviously this is a road bike with nice thin and rock hard road bike tyres so it makes it very bumpy when you go off road but that's really what you want basically nice thin very hard tyres very little resistance and makes it a very easy very smooth fast ride. And I suppose really at this point I should sum things up and wrap this video up and say I'm very pleased with it. I do absolutely love the way that everything seems to just work nicely and it's all very smooth. I will post future proper reviews and updates as my time with this bike continues. And I suppose for now I'll say thank you very much for watching. Check out my other videos for loads more biking and fixies and all sorts of stuff as you've just seen all lined up in that room at the start of this video. Until the next time, subscribe, check out my other videos, keep it bike-worthy, and have a fantastic day. Farewell.